Sammy yeah. Buendia. Oh, Buendia with pass. a great ball over to the left-hand side, and Yanulis is on the front foot, plays it in field to uh, Campwell, who returns oh, it to Yanulis, who's in the penalty area. Chance for Yanulis, oh, and it's blocked. Oh, Excellent sprawling block there by the experienced Richie Keogh. Threw himself on the line there, but it's rebounded for Campwell on the left-hand side. Clever run from him into the penalty area. Goes Campwell, tries oh, it across the Puki, and that's a goal for Norwich City. They've only needed seven and a half minutes. Brilliant work from Todd Campwell on the left-hand side to dribble the ball into the penalty area, choose his moments, cut it back to Puki, and Puki just got the shot on target and gives Norwich an early lead. The Canaries won, Huddersfield nil. It's Timu Puki. Start off, ball in the middle of midfield. T uh, Emi Buendia, great pass all the way out to Nulis. Goes in, gets his shot off, great, great block by Keogh, comes back to Toddy, great little shift to the left, lift to the right, puts it on the floor, comes in, Timo Puga right across him. Oh, what, what great player. Todd Cantwell, unbelievable feat, by the way. Now McLean just been caught in possession by Holmes, but Buendia works hard to win the ball straight back for Norwich City. McLean uses it well this time and finds Buendia, who plays it early. In behind the Huddersfield oh, defence, it's a lovely pass, and Pukki's onto it, and he's in Pukki, and oh, that's his second game. goal! What a pass from Emi Buendia from the halfway line. He's cut the Huddersfield defence in two. Pukki races onto it, one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. He scored twice inside the first 20 minutes, and it's Norwich City 2, Huddersfield Town nil. Just easy, just too easy. But Amy Bundy gets the ball at his feet, opens up, just a little clip into the channel. He doesn't even do anything with it. The two, this is what I talk about Timo Puka's move, but they just, they just don't see it coming. He floats around, he waits for the defender, just waits for them. They've got a, the two set of halves. Oh my God, I'm going to do some of water. First touch, fantastic. Second one, rifled it, near stick right in the top corner. Puki. Again, they've played him in. Again, Huddersfield can't pick him up. That Buendia has it, 25 yards from goal. He's going to hit one. Oh, oh it's three! Yeah, no. Emi Buendia in off the post. Norris City are running riot. This is a promotion procession from the Canaries. We've only played for 23 minutes. Puki's got two. Buendia has just perfectly placed one in off the post. There is no stopping Norwich City in the championship in this sort of form. It's Norwich three, Huddersfield nil. They just don't, they don't know if they're coming or going. Norwich just keep the ball effortless. To be fair, the ball goes into Timo Puki. If he actually lets it go across him, he's in. If he actually lets it go across him, he actually has a bad touch just behind him. Then plays everywhere in it. One thing we know for sure, you can't just let him turn and shoot from the edge of the box. Great, nice whip inside the inside the foot comes off the post and in the back of the net three 0 Buendia finds Aaron's on the right hand side. Norwich are already three 0 up and the ball's been played by uh, Aaron's into the penalty area for Buendia who sets up Camwell. That's four. Oh, what a finish! But that is another great finish from a Norwich City attacking player. Puki's got two. Buendia getting one and now Todd Campwell gets in on the act. We haven't even been playing for half an hour, and at Carra Road, it is Norwich City 4, Huddersfield 0. They are absolutely destroying the visitors here. But, do you know something? You... <laughs> I don't know what to say. It's just so easy. Ball comes out to Max Ahrens, no one close it down. Little pass into Buendia, great turn. Managed to pick his head up as much as he wants. Top ground, a great finish, whips it in the top corner. But it's just so easy. Norwich have already got four inside the first 33 minutes, and it will be McLean who will lay it off for Buendia! Oh, he rattles the crossbar! Pookie with the header from the rebound, he's offside. That thumped the crossbar, wow. didn't it? Great, that great. Almost took the goal out of the ground. Yeah, great great little touch. Kenny McLean just runs over the ball, a little slide to right. Emmy comes in and absolutely spanks it right off the bar. Well, well, the keeper was just watching. He's not one move, does he? <laughs> Poor old Joel Pereira. It's gone back to the goalkeeper, Pereira, who's being closed down. He kicks it away. Snow falling more and more heavily now. Yanulis has it on the left-hand side. Oh, Buendia's too strong. He's got it on the edge of the penalty area. Through to Dowell. Lovely touch. Oh back to God. Buendia, who's in. He oh lays it off God. for Dowell. Oh, oh, that's a wonderful goal. It's five for Norwich City. We've still got four minutes to go to half-time. Kieran Dowell and Timu Puki and Emi Buendia turning on the party tricks tonight. Todd Campbell's been in on the act as well. That one was all about Buendia and Dowell. Little one-twos through the penalty area. A tap-in for Dowell. This is 5-0 for Norwich City. And we've only been playing for 42 minutes. That is absolutely ridiculous. The, the pattern of play was sensational. The movement all the way, skip coming all the way to the right, going all the way left. Then it goes into Buendia. Great little turn. 
rolls his man, Bill flick it to Dowell, Dowell flicks it outside his right over the head of the defender. Emmy, intelligence, not just to hit it, gets his head up, pulls it back to him, Dowell puts in. Absolute, unbelievable goal. Great play. Huddersfield looking to do something about that now. They've got the ball on the left-hand side with Thomas. The substitute brings it into the penalty area here. Silver Thomas has a shot and Krull down smartly to his near post to turn it behind. De Haley takes a touch. Campbell tries to steal it off him, but the right-back has got forward here for Huddersfield. Then Bakuna tries to play it forward. Excellent interception from Omabama Daly. And now Skip can set off through the midfield. And he's pacey and he's full of running and he's accelerating up to the edge of the penalty area here. What a run from Skip into the box. He goes, he's been brought down, has he? It's a penalty! Norris said he have a penalty. And this is the chance for Timo Puki to score what will be... If he gets it, his first, first ever, ever hat championship yeah. hat-trick. That was a great run from Skip, though, yeah, isn't it? Let's great. just hear it for him. He just he just picks up the ball in so many good positions. He, he just always He's always in the right place at the right time to pick it up. Great run. I thought he was actually going to slide team, but he holds on to it. And to be fair, in the end, it was a, he went down the defender. I don't know what the defender's doing. Looking for his 25th goal of the season. Here's Puki with the right foot, and he tucks it away! And that is a first championship hat-trick for Timu Puki. There's a, a fist pump to celebrate it. High fives now from all of his teammates. Norwich City have hit Huddersfield for six. And Timu Puki finally has a championship hat-trick to his name, completed with a penalty. The goalkeeper got down to it, but couldn't keep it out. And Huddersfield just haven't been able to keep Norwich out tonight. We've still got half an hour to go, and it's Norwich City six, Huddersfield nil. Corner, left-hand side to Huddersfield here, in front of the Barkley end at Carrow Road. Played in from the left-hand side. Headed goalwards and he's hit the post. Rebound from Ward is blocked by Krull. He's made a good save there. It was Dehaney who got his head to that one, hit the post, and Krull's had to make a decent save there. Great header, great great ball in. Great corner whipped in, great header. Just ricochets off the side. I'm trying to see who... I think it was Dehaney who won the first header. Dehaney, header. great header, comes back. Then look, I think Tim Krull in the end gets a, gets a foot to it off Ward. Ball played for by Sorensen. Oh, Aarons has made a run as centre forward and he lays the ball off now for Steeperman. And here is oh, Aarons Max. in the penalty area. Plays it across. This is a chance. Oh, oh and it's yeah. rifled oh. in by Hugh Gill. He's got goal number seven for Norwich City. And that was finished uh, with uh, the aplomb of a man who's been watching a team create chances for 75 minutes and just wanted to get on there and get a piece of the action. And as it was rolled across the edge of the six yard box, Hugh Gill has blasted that in. It is Norwich City seven. Huddersfield Town nil, and we're at the point now where you're going to need brackets uh, to add to the scoreline. S E V E N. Norwich are putting Huddersfield to the sword. S some, somehow, Max Aaron has turned from a right back into a running behind centre forward. Timu, a 7 0 win and a hat trick for yourself. It's not bad to hear the office. No, uh, it's pretty good, uh, I would say so. It was a uh, Nice, nice game to be a part of, and uh, yeah, enjoyed, enjoyed a lot. Uh, I think we played, uh, played pretty good football today. What should I lie? Anyhow, of course, it was a, was a great, uh, great night and uh, top class all round performance. Uh, scored many goals, created many, many uh, fantastic team goals. I think the most remarkable was was that we kept going from the first to the last second to our pressing, our counter pressing, even in the second half when it was clear that we would win this game was spot on and, and really absolutely focused and, and, and really greedy anyhow and and you got the feeling every every player was just thinking about the team and was willing to invest with uh, intensity and it's always the same yeah when you're willing to to invest and your class can also shine and our class was shining uh, a lot today and of course we're happy with the result happy with the three points happy also with the clean sheet happy yeah with seven goals good for the goal uh, difference uh, yeah we edge closer to what we want to achieve in the end and for that yeah, of course, a fantastic night, and I hope we were also capable to entertain our supporters a little bit because this is why we, we play this game. So, just should imagine how great the atmosphere would have been if um, Kill Road would have been full packed. So, hopefully, pretty soon. But also hope we, we could give them some some something to cheer about tonight and to enjoy the game. And um, yeah, it was definitely a good performance.